Pretty boy. Oh, gorgeous face boy. It's been overwhelming, but it's been, it, I don't think it's really um, sank in yet. Like we're still so wrapped up around everybody that is supporting us and, and then people that aren't supporting us. We've been dealing with that so much and I don't think I've had a day since we've come home that my phone has not rang off the hook um, with people wanting to do interviews and donate care packages and stuff. So we stay pretty busy. We're, we're pretty much doing something all the time. Um, but he handles it very well. He is he's a happy baby. He doesn't cry a whole lot unless he's hungry or wants a pacifier. Um, he's, he's adjusted really well. And I feel like he's more comfortable now that he's at home in his own routine than he was in the hospital. But he, he sleeps through the night already. Um, he's eating more. He's gaining weight. He's doing really well. In a couple weeks, we'll be going to Houston and Galveston. Galveston is for plastic surgery. We'll get a game plan as far as a cosmetic nose goes. And then in the same week, we will be going from there to Houston. And um, we will see a craniofacialist there at the Shriners Hospital for Children. And there we will have his scans to see if he has sinus cavities and nasal passages. So that'll be the first of many trips out that way. I just want to thank everybody. We have had more support than I ever imagined. And uh, um, it's for every one person that has something rude and negative to say, there's 30,000 people jumping down their throats and defending Eli. Um, and I'd, I'd made a comment, not even realizing how far it would go, but I'd made a comment saying Eli has his own little army, and now that's, that's a trend. There's a hashtag Eli's army behind everybody's post now. Those things mean a lot to us. Those, I don't think people understand how much gratitude we have for that, because we have moments, a lot, where we're kind of, we're stressed, we're scared, we're burnt out, and those things help us keep going. Since he's come home, we've been so busy wrapped up in doing stuff with the fundraiser and interviews and stuff. We haven't really had time to sit down and just enjoy our three kids together as a family. So that is everybody's plan after today is just take a breath and relax. <laughs>